this would be your second IPO. And what are the lessons you've learned from your first that you could apply to the second? Don't do it. <laughs> well, <laughs> you know, we both have had very good outcomes from our, our public company experience. So. And it, listen, these are all learning experiences. And they, you know, um, you know, I think because we have gone through that, we, we, we know what to expect. We know if you're going to be in a public market, if you do not have reliable, recurring, growing profitability, forget about it. Mm -hmm. That's, that, those are the metrics. And yes, maybe people get sideways for a minute or two and suddenly get exuberant about you know, growth over you know, profitability and then they wake up and go, well, maybe that's not the best idea. <clears throat> We've lived through this, we, we, we understand it. And so there's no mystery <clears throat> to us and I think when there is the right opportunity and when it's of, you know, when it strategically um, accelerates what we're doing, we will be there with bells and whistles on. But right now, today, we have a company doing $300 million in revenue, growing like a rocket ship. It's a profitable business. We have hundreds of millions of dollars in the bank. So we're not driven to do anything other than create a vehicle that can create shareholder value. 